Hello everybody, welcome back. This is a golden chain tree, or it used to be a golden chain tree. And as most of you know that's been following me, this used to be my dad's rental house. And right over here used to be the well. Of course we have a actual dug well now, or not dug well, one that they sunk the pipe in. And so that one was filled. This used to have a little house around it, and this golden chain tree was here. Well, the renters decided they didn't like it up against the shed, so they just whacked it off. So here I have a bunch of these, I guess we'll call them suckers, which are actually a nice tree still, or it looks like a bush, and it keeps spreading out. I trimmed all these off before trying to just train three or four good branches, and it just keeps spreading like it is. So what I plan on doing is trying to dig some of these up and transplanting them so they can be a good tree and I'll still leave this big main one here because it is pretty when it does bloom and it's a great place for the hummingbirds to land on the branches and that kind of stuff. So let me get at it. I'm going to try to figure this out of digging this up and seeing what kind of roots I can get in order to transplant it and make it healthy. Uh, right now our temperatures are, let's see, last night it got down to 24 and that's because we didn't have a cloud cover. We do have clouds coming in and hopefully it'll start warming up again. We've had weather that it didn't drop down below 40 degrees. So we're still in winter but uh, it's becoming spring. We do have the daffodils up. No tulips yet but we're getting there. So anyway, let's dig this thing up and see what happens. Let's get at her. We do have nice healthy worms here. Time to put them in the soil again, out of harm's way. This is the first one I dug out. I'm gonna go ahead and get it planted. I'm not gonna stake it, I'm gonna watch it, and if need be, I'll stake it later. But I do have some decent roots on here, and where I was digging, Looks like there was another tree knocked out there too because they had uh, big old two to three inch uh, stumps, I guess we'll say, sitting in there and these grew off of it. So let me get this thing planted before I dig up the rest of them. Anytime you're planting a tree, it don't matter if it's raining out or what, you should always water the roots. That helps get rid of the air surrounding it. And in the winter, you can't overwater because it'll drain off. So I'll put that water there for now. I'll go ahead and fill up the bucket again with water. I'm going to go ahead and fill this hole where I want it, and we'll be probably set for this one. Okay, let's go get some more water. That one's set. I do have a, my house is sitting right over there, so I have a branch coming off this way. And of course the main trunk, and I have branches coming out. So it's gonna be nice for the birds, like I say, to land on, especially the hummingbirds, and also hopefully the traffic noise a little bit. 
it's always nice to have some shade too. It may get hot during the summer, but the more trees you have, the cooler it might be. So plant a tree.